North Korea, the most isolated country in the world. It's called the Hermit Kingdom, a secretive country. North Korea is a mix of dictatorship, monarchy, and tyranny. It's infamous for many things. One such thing is its military. It's one of the poorest countries in the world. People have only bare minimum to get by, but the country spends billions of dollars on its military. In 2022, North Korea dramatically increased missile tests, and now it's in the news for its massive military parade. Here's all that you need to know about it. North Korea recently held a military parade. It was to commemorate the 75th anniversary of the Korea People's Army. It displayed more intercontinental ballistic missiles or ICBMs than ever before. What is an ICBM? It's a guided missile designed to deliver nuclear weapons. Their minimum range is about 5,500 kilometers. Some can travel over 10,000 kilometers. They can be launched from multiple platforms. This includes submarines, heavy trucks, trains, making them difficult to detect. ICBMs are typically smaller than rockets. They travel in arc-like paths, similar to a football. How much destruction can an ICBM cause? It can strike a target from thousands of miles away, and it can destroy entire cities. Which countries have ICBMs? India, the United States, Russia, China, Britain, France, and North Korea. How many ICBMs does North Korea have? We don't know. Nobody knows the exact number. In 2017, North Korea conducted the first successful test of the Hwasong-14 ICBM. In the same year, it launched a new ICBM, the Hwasong-15. This was alarming. Experts believe that both missiles can fly 10,000 kilometers. To put that in context, a missile fired from North Korea can reach the US mainland, which is about 9,000 kilometers away. In March 2022, the country launched its massive Hwasong-17 ICBM. Now let's take a closer look at the recent parade. This parade was like no other. Fireworks illuminated the sky. Troops performed gun salutes. The national flag was hoisted. State media aired ads of soldiers training in various locations. Soldiers were shown breaking chains, chopping ice blocks with bare hands, and jumping into freezing water. Kim Jong-un was not just showing off his nuclear arsenal at the parade, but also his daughter, who was front and center. Her name is Kim Ju a She's around 10 years old, and bears a striking resemblance to her father. She is believed to be Kim Jong-un's second oldest child. This is her fifth public appearance in less than three months. She was introduced to the media as Kim Jong-un's beloved daughter. Her presence has added to speculations that she could be his successor. That possibility seems quite likely. Since the foundation of North Korea, the country has been ruled by three generations of the Kim family. Citizens are made to believe that this family hails from a sacred bloodline, and only they can lead the country. There's one more thing striking about this parade. Kim Jong-un's wife, Ri Sol-ju, wore a rocket-shaped pendant. It looks similar to the ICBM Hwasong-17. We don't know if this makes a good piece of jewelry, but it certainly led to a good amount of speculation. The flamboyant parade was held at a time when the country is facing worsening food and economic crisis. But as it continues to flex its military muscle, the rest of the world is left wondering what will be Kim's next move.